Hi guys, this is Callum from English Shooting as always. I thought I would make this quick video because I always talk about the guns and the guns that I own um, and specifically the guns that I use for three gun and practical shotgun and mini rifle. And of course for three gun you need a pistol and in the UK that's a long barrel pistol and then you need a semi-automatic rifle, usually the 1522 or the 1022, um, and then you need a high capacity uh, semi-automatic or pump action shotgun. You can do it with sort of any gun you want, it's all about the fun, but those are usually the guns and I talk about them a lot and I thought I would actually make a quick video showing you the other accessories that I use. Uh, now this is my belt, this is what I use for practical shooting and three gun and it's the ghost rigid carbon fiber belt and it's got a really neat feature that it comes in two parts you have the main rigid section and as you can see it's all in place and then you have this inner that's velcroed so when you want to go off for lunch you can just take this off place it down go off for lunch when you want to come back or even when you're waiting around to shoot you just undo it put it against the velcro piece Do it up at the back, make sure it's all in place, and there you go, you're ready to go. There's no looping it round or putting a belt on or taking it off, it's really quick and simple. So I absolutely love this belt, I was using it for the weekend of the Netherlands shoot and then I came back and bought one straight away. Now what I have on my belt is pretty much standard for sort of three gun and practical shooting in the UK, so I have my uh, 1911 holster, this is again a, go a ghost holster and it fits my 1911 GSG. I then got caddies. Now, there's many different flavors of caddies. These are the Tacom um, dueling juices or the double juices, and I can hold eight shells on there, and it allows me to easily grab them for dual loading or quad loading. They've got a tack on back, so they can pop off and pop, pop on uh, really easily. More useful when I had the 511 belt, because obviously with this I can just take the whole belt off easily now. Um, on the other side I've got some uh, Ghost 1911 single stack magazine holsters, obviously for the 1911, um, and then I've got these for the Smith, again Ghost, and you can fit other AR-15 style magazines in there, but obviously I use them for the 1522. So that's pretty much my setup. and. I wanted to make this video also basically to give a massive thank you to AW Armoury. Now, if you follow the Facebook channel or even the YouTube channel for a while, you will know that I pretty much buy all my gear from AW Armoury. And I'm very grateful for the fact that AW Armoury has partnered up with English Shooting um, and is now sort of supplying me with you know, little goodies here and there. So. This isn't basically me shouting out, promoting them because they've given me a load of free stuff. I've used them before, I've bought and paid my own money for them, for all the bits before. You know, when you look at this belt, you know, pretty much everyone, everything on here I've paid for myself. These are one of the first things that AW have given me. I really stand behind the company and I really stand behind the products that they sell. You know, I would happily pay my own money for them. And I just want to let you guys know that AW Armoury is a great source for all the practical, sort of hard to get equipment within the UK. I'll put a link in the description below for their website and I really would go and have a look. I spend you know, many hours just looking on their website, looking at all the new stuff and writing my wish list. So you can go and check it out. So there you go, that's pretty much my belt and my setup for uh, practical shooting. You'll probably see a lot more of it. I've added and taken away things as I've gone, but this is pretty much my setup now. Uh, let me know what you like to use in the comment section below. As always, thank you very much for watching this video and I hope to see you soon.